103. That's the number of suspected overdoses in Manchester so far this month. That's an enormous amount of overdoses for a city this size. Chris Daywa's regional director for AMR says the city is also nearing a record for the amount of Narcan administered in a 30-day period. We need help to combat this crisis because people are dying. First responders have been hoping for extra federal help since President Trump talked about declaring the opioid crisis a national emergency. New Hampshire drug czar David Mara says the governor is in contact with the president, but it's unclear when more federal dollars could be available. Once we find out, we'll uh, take the appropriate action to make sure that uh, New Hampshire gets its uh, fair share of the funds. Officials say the trends are unpredictable. Nashua has stayed around 30 suspected overdoses a month for much of this year. It's a supply and demand thing and there's a very large demand here and unfortunately there's a supply to go along with it. There's abundance of uh, drugs, not just uh, not just opioids, but it's out there and it's available. Mara says people want help and the state is always working toward better options. Why take the chance? Uh, go to safe stations uh, or if you're, no matter what part of the state you are in, call 211, find out where services are. There are a lot of people in the state that are ready to help, want to help. There are still three days left in this month. Officials say those numbers could rise and unfortunately, more records could be broken. Reporting in Manchester, Siobhan Lopez, WMUR News 9.